My name is Genevieve. I'm a paleoanthropologist and rock art researcher. And this is the Q&A edition with World of Paleoanthropology. Now, Seth and I are going to answer some of the more complicated questions together in a longer session later, but we got so many awesome questions from everyone, thank you for that, that we agreed that I would try and be brief, which is hard for me, um, and answer some of the more straightforward questions in a short answer edition, which is what we're doing right here. Now, Pilar asked some great questions, which are really good building block questions with like Rock Art 101, which was what time period do we find the signs in and where do we find them around the world? So. Here's our whirlwind answers. First of all, if we're gonna start in Europe, which is sort of the well-known Ice Age area. And so in Europe, most of the art dates to between 10,000 and 45,000 years ago. But in recent years, we have been using uranium series dating and we are starting to get some older dates as well. So we've now got some sites that are dating 65,000 plus years ago. So extending that one out, um, and also of course, opening up the possibility of Neanderthals in Europe making art because of that age. So lots to still discover and lots of art that remains to be dated, but majority at this point is probably between 10,000 and 45,000, but now 65,000, maybe even possibly older. In Africa, at this point, we don't have cave art or wall art that's as old, but that also could be there's a lot of places where dating still needs to be done, where more documentation needs to be done. So stay tuned, we could find some. But we do have portable art in Africa with geometric signs like lines and crosses and zigzags and hash marks that date back to 100,000 years ago. And so say 80 to 100,000, we've got a number of artifacts now that have these sort of geometric markings, but in a portable form. So on little ochres, on bones, on stones, things like that. No wall art at, at this point, but that could change. If we shift out to where our ancestors moved out around the old and new world, it's really important to note that there are a lot of blank spots on the map that are probably not blank. It's just that people have not documented them and added them to our knowledge base for rock art at this point. But so I would say not so blank as, as it currently looks if you look at a map. But one of the other big concentrations is in Australia. And I think the oldest like hard dates they have right now are around 40,000 for some of the sites. But there is some really strong thought that some of the art could easily be 60,000 years old, maybe even older, because that is when the first people came down to Australia. And of course, they probably brought their cultural art making traditions with them. So they were probably doing art from the beginning. But dating when you get back that far can be a little bit tricky because you really need the right materials and the right conditions for that to work. But you know, I mean, this amazing technology era we're in, who knows what can happen next. Perfect example of that is up, up the globe from there into Indonesia, where in recent years, there's been amazing dates coming out of there. And so in Indonesia, we now have dates pushing 45,000 years, including of actual hunting animals, which is really unusual because in a lot of places in the world, it's not animals that are dated that old. Um, but there are also signs that date to that range as well. So I would say if you're looking around the world and then of course we can move into the Americas where there's been so much controversy, which is everything's always been pushed younger and it's so odd to me because why wouldn't it be very old just like everything else is? I mean, literally people were moving around the globe. They were moving in, they were moving out. Um, they were just following herds, doing their thing, right? And um, we've got some some, glimmers of very ancient dates from the Americas, both North America and South America. So that's an area where definitely a lot more work still remains to be done. But in South America, I have heard of dates in the 25,000, even 30,000 year range, um, potentially. And I'm guessing the same is probably true in North America, but I don't know how much has been dated yet. Yeah, it's, there's so much to be done, but suffice it to say that all around the world, there is a lot of ancient rock art and we find signs everywhere where we find art. So thanks Pilar for that question.